let's take a look at the Synth NV operating in standalone mode. Okay, so when the, the unit comes from the factory, it's set up at one gigahertz. And that's, that's already in the memory. And it's, and it's also the level that you get out is going to be a, a certain level. So let's take a look at that. Now, if you want to run the thing through this, this power DC input right here, it says plus seven volts DC and it clearly is marked on here as to, the connector is center positive. So it needs about 300 milliamps to run properly. So what we have here, we're, we have these nice little supplies here, which are called the 600 milliamp universals, and we sell these. And these have, a, these have an adjustable um, output on them. There's a little key that you can set on the thing. So what I've got is I've set it for 6 volts, and uh, what I'm going to do is plug it in right here, center positive. And then I'm going to turn it on. We're going to see what happens. Okay. Oh, okay. There you go. So what we have here is, is we have the, um, the 1 gigahertz frequency coming out. And the level is about minus 10.74. So it's about minus, minus 11 dBm. And that's approximately what you're supposed to get out of this thing if you haven't put anything in other than, you know, what's the factory default setting on it. So the, the point of this is that you can use this thing as a standalone uh, device in some other application where you just need some sort of an RF output or you need a modulated output. You can, you can program your settings into this thing and then anytime you power it up, that's what you'll get.